How's it going everyone? My name is Bobby and you're watching Mind Island Design. Today I'm going to show you a few different ways you can create a clipping mask in InDesign. I'm just going to create a basic circle by grabbing my ellipse frame tool here. And just selecting the top of the moon and holding shift, I'm going to roughly make a symmetrical circle the size of the moon. That's a good size there. And just with the selection tool, I'm going to align this frame to the center. And as we can see, the moon is not a perfect circle, so I'm going to just make some minor adjustments here. And that should be good. Just using the arrow keys, I'm going to just make some more minor adjustments. All right, so the next thing you want to do is to select your image, go to edit, cut, and then you want to select your frame or clipping mask and go to edit, paste into. And just like that, you got your your basic circle clipping mask. So let's say I want to make a crescent moon. I'm going to use this circle to start and with my direct selection tool, I'm going to select this anchor point here. I want to hold shift and click so it creates this, this handle. And now I'm going to just drag this to the right to kind of make a crescent moon. It's looking more like a sausage, but I'll, uh, I'll try and make it look a little nicer. I'm going to select the top anchor point and make that uh, a sharp point, I guess. Same at the bottom. And now it's looking more like a flying saucer, so I guess we will deal with that for the sake of the tutorial. Um, and again, same process, select in the back, edit, cut. Now you can just paste that back into your frame. Paste into. And it might even be easier if you, if you adjust your your uh, frame with your clipping mask. So yeah, I would definitely uh, tweak that a lot more. That is a pretty rough looking crescent moon, but you get the idea that you can make any custom shape. And uh, another cool thing you can do is um, you can put images and text. So I'm gonna just delete this clipping mask there and let me just type in something if I can find my text tool there. So let me just make a little text box here and I'll just type moon. Let's make that uh, something like 60. And I'll just grab our brand text, which is Poppins. And let me just drag this more to the center. And then you just want to go to type, create outlines. So now uh, the text actually has path around it. So same process, selecting your image, go to edit, cut, select your, your path, edit, paste into. And just like that actually looks pretty cool. I, I like that. And I will center this. So yeah, that is how you create a clipping mask in InDesign. I hope this video helped. If it did, please hit subscribe and follow us on all of our social media to stay connected and never miss a new tutorial. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.